MapLab for ArcGIS Pro. Splitting Parcels. Once you draw a parcel with the Traverse tool and it has acceptable closure, you will need to make the change to your parcel layer. To do this, first make parcels the only selectable layer by right-clicking on the layer, choose Selection, and make this the only selectable layer. Next, select the parent parcel that needs to be split. From the Tools menu, click Split. To split the parcel, you can click once outside the parcel, then once on the edge where the split needs to occur, once on the opposite side of the split, and once outside the parcel again. Right-click and press Finish. The parent and child parcel should flash blue. Depending on the shape of the split, you might want to use the Trace tool or another method entirely. Let's name the child parcel Parcel2. To do that, select the child parcel and click Attributes from the Edit menu. In the Pin field, type Parcel2 and press Enter. The newly split parcel is now labeled Parcel2. That was one way to split a parcel. But what's another common way? Let's say you have a boundary change, like a lot line adjustment, that states the south 25 feet of Parcel1 deeds to the owner of Parcel2. Here's one way you could do that without using the Traverse tool or construction lines. Select Parcel1 and click the Split tool. Click once on the southwest corner to begin the split. Next, right-click and select Distance. Type 25 feet. Now you can snap to the west edge of Parcel 1. Click once there. Now hover the cursor over the south line of Parcel 1. Right-click and select Parallel. Your split will now follow the same angle as the south line of Parcel 1. Click on the east line of Parcel 1. Right-click and select Finish. Now you have the south 25 feet of Parcel 1 split off, and we need to merge it into Parcel 2. To do that, select the south 25 feet of Parcel 1 and Parcel 2 and press Merge. Select the feature for Parcel 2 so that its attributes are preserved and press Merge. Now Parcel 2 should include the south 25 feet of Parcel 1. Remember to save your edits if it worked how you expected. Those are a couple common ways to split a parcel in ArcGIS Pro.